three, two, one. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the vlog. And I'm here with Madame Bones and... Soba. This vlog is gonna be a little bit different. You see this set over here? This set was care of Madame Bonizi. She's my production designer for today. Yes, and this is basically our whole coffee set at home. We have a home brewing set that all of us use. And as some of you might have noticed, in every single vlog that I've ever made, there has been at least one coffee shop, one coffee shot, or one coffee reference. Hindi pwedeng walang coffee. So coffee is our lifeblood. It's something we absolutely love and we can absolutely talk about for years on end, forever. This vlog could go on forever if we're going to talk about coffee. I think it's also come to the point where we love even just the taste and smell of coffee. It's been really nice to see that our enthusiasm for coffee has kind of extended and influenced our viewers. That some of them have actually become quite interested in it. And it's cool when you guys mention that you've been to the coffee shops that we've been to or that we've recommended to you guys because <laughs> For today on this vlog, we are going to make hot coffee, iced coffee, and some coffee jelly. And by the way, before we get the tutorial started, for the very first time in my channel, I am holding, we are holding a giveaway. So we want to be able to share with you guys our coffee recipe so that you can make it at home and we will be giving away a whole coffee brewing set. We will give you the details of the giveaway at the end of this video. In the meantime, we gotta teach you how to make our coffee. So here we go, three coffees, hot coffee, that's our version, our version of iced coffee, and a coffee jelly, which I've never done, but Bone said she knows how to do so. I'm not sure she does. Today we're gonna make some coffee. We're gonna make hot, <laughs> hot coffee. Hot coffee. Hot coffee. Hot coffee. Hot coffee. Okay. Cold coffee. Say hot coffee. Hot coffee. Say hot coffee. Hot coffee. The wrong. Hot coffee. Hot coffee. <laughs> hot coffee tutorial in three, two, one. You know the saying, don't do these things at home? Well, that's one thing you can only do at home. Someone does that in a coffee shop. And now let's talk about how we brew our hot coffee. All you need is 20 grams of coffee and 320 ml of water. Heat it at 92 degrees. First step is you grind your beans and you heat the water, obviously. And then you put the coffee into the V60 and pour your first pour of water. Pour your first pour of water. You basically pour around 50 ml of water in your first hit. That's basically the blooming part. And you let it sit for around 30 seconds. After 30 seconds, you pour in the rest of the water up to around 220 ml. You let that sit so that the coffee can extract just a bit. And before all the water goes down, you pour up to the rest of the coffee, which is 320 ml of water. You pour up? You pour, you pour in. in. You pour, you pour in the rest How of the water. Pour? You pour in the rest of the water and then it becomes 320 ml. Thank you very much. And basically your target brewing time for the whole process, including the blooming, is around two and a half minutes. And after two and a half, even if there's a bit of water inside the ground, you take it off. Perfect for the afternoon. It's so yummy! 
Oh, really? Remember the first time we tried this? Oh, yeah, this is That was not our best brewing technique. <laughs> we were brewing for the camera and not for the taste. No. Apparently, it's not a Decaf is perfect for us for the late afternoon because we love having coffee when it's super hot outside just to like have a refresher. And if we take too much caffeine, then we won't be able to sleep. So this is just the right beverage for us. Right mm. beverage. Who uses beverage? Over the years that we've been drinking coffee, we've developed our own nuances and borrowed nuances from other people. One would be wetting the paper filter. It's not always needed, but some people say that it takes out that papery taste. In the coffee, if you're particular about it, then go ahead and do it. If not, then it doesn't really matter. To be honest with you, I can't tell the difference between papery taste and not, so I tend to not pre-wet the filter. If you have the taste senses of a top chef, then fine, go ahead and yeah. do it. I think that Bones and I, over the years, we've changed our technique and brewing process and parameters and even our equipment at least five to ten times already. When we see something interesting on YouTube, we try it out and we have fun. And I don't think you should be afraid of having or creating a bad cup of coffee yeah. because I think that's part of the process and that's part of enjoying your coffee life. I think what's really fun about making coffee is when you visit coffee shops and you get to talk to the baristas on how they make their coffee. And that's how we've learned a lot of the recipes that we know today. Additionally, coffee has become such an experiential and integral part of our relationship. We've mm -hmm. grown so much through coffee. And that's also why we're super pushing this giveaway and giving away a coffee brewing set for someone to be able to explore this side of themselves. Hey, you never know. Baka magka love life ka sa coffee mo. Wow, you love life with your coffee. I have love life. I'm just going to strengthen my love life. I'm just going to Maybe, maybe not. Mm -hmm. So our last recipe that we are going to show you is Bonizi's Coffee Jelly. I have never ever made this. I think I might have tried it once. I don't even think she's made this in the past few years. So I don't know what she's doing. Okay, so what's happening first? We're doing an experiment because honestly I don't know what I'm doing. The face of someone who has no idea what she's doing. See? While Bonizi is trying to figure out what her recipe is, this is kind of the fun part when it comes to coffee because we like trying out different recipes. We've come to the point where we're confident enough to try things out and experiment. And I find that fun because sometimes the experiments go really, really bad that it's really funny. And other times it's just like genius. Einstein genius. And it tastes so good. But that rarely happens. Usually it's somewhere in the middle. One and a half. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, oh, shoot. Shut up. Ooh. <laughs> that was so gross what she did. That does not represent my hygiene. <laughs> I would do that on the mom. It represents her hygiene. Excuse me. So we're gonna sugar it up. We don't usually sugar our coffee, but... That's how she looks. And now for the coffee jelly. I have absolutely nothing to do with this, so Bones is gonna do all the talking. This is my second time to make a coffee jelly ever in my life, so I just learned. This is my first. All you need is one pack of gelatin. Was, 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 was. I'm challenging Bones to say her recipe in 20 seconds. Ready? Go! Heat two cups of coffee in a pot on the stove, and while that's heating up, you mix the gelatin with two tablespoons of cold water. Make sure that it's cold so that it doesn't get lumpy and bumpy. Then you put the gelatin mixture into the pot, and then you mix it, mix it, mix it. Put one tablespoon of sugar, mix it, mix it, mix it, and then put it in the wrap, and then you're good, and then put milk and condensed milk, and then you're good. Okay. Done. I don't know if you guys got that, but if you did, good job. Not bad, Bones. I think you got that well. <laughs> and there you go. We shared our two most important coffee recipes and our one most unimportant coffee recipe with you guys. But now is the time that some of you might be waiting for. It is giveaway time. And these are the two questions you have to answer to join the giveaway. The first question is, between Fofo and Bones, who would you love to have coffee with and why? Answer below down in the comment section. We will pick our favorite answer and that person will win a complete brewing set care of yardstick coffee. Wait, you said two questions. 
You said, who would you like to have coffee with and why? It just sounds like one question, that's why. Just answer below, leave a comment, and our favorite answer will win a brewing set care of yardstick. That includes heating kettle, an AeroPress, some coffee beans, coffee a grinder. hand grinder, and some love from Bones and Fofo. Yay! By the way, if you're gonna answer this question, I make better coffee than Fofo. Of course not. Yes, I do. <laughs> oh my god. Yes, yeah, she makes better coffee than me, but I'll take you abroad for coffee. Oh. <laughs> After the grand winner, we also are giving away 10 consolation prizes. Care of Yardstick, so please do keep your answers rolling. The next 10 best answers will get a consolation prize. Thank you so much, Yardstick. They've been absolutely amazing. Check them out on their Instagram and their YouTube. Now you know all of our coffee secrets, and now might be time for you to make your own. It's time for us to make our own coffee also again. So